Hi Virgos, this is Nayla Latrice. I am here to do a read for you guys. If you guys are interested in your own personal readings, coaching, or donating to the channel, you guys can do so at the links below, okay? So Virgo, the first card out that we have for you is the Two of Swords. So I feel like you guys are stuck in between a rock and a hard place is what I'm hearing. It's like you guys have some type of decision that you guys have to make. Could be in regards to some type of... Um, uh, uh, some decision that's been weighing on your heart, okay, could be with the Leo as well, but I feel like whatever this is, it's taking a lot of strength to make this decision, okay, or you've been strong and it's taken a lot of strength to get you to where you are now, and now you're coming to this place to where you have to make some decision, or something is getting ready to close out, okay, yeah, um, I saw the eight of wands, but also the nine of wands here, so it's kind of like you're waiting for something, or somebody could be on the outside looking in there's some type of communication coming in we have the ace of cups some type of new opportunity that is very well deserved that you worked for that you could have fought for okay um you just it's like i just keep hearing you deserve it you deserve it you deserve it and look that this look at what wants to come out y'all see it backwards right look at what wants to come out this eight of wands so this there's some type of communication that's coming in okay that um you're going to have to respond to or there is some type of communication that has come in that you're uh, responding to or that you're going to have to make a decision about look it could be your manifestations virgo okay it's like you over here you over here manifesting you don't see that your manifestations are right here and that's what exactly is coming in towards you as well okay could have Leo in your chart or something happened during Leo season, but you're definitely manifesting. Also could be dealing with a Gemini here. Um, again, this Ace of Cups wants to show up along with this tower. So this could be some type of new um, opportunity that is coming towards you, some type of fulfillment, some type of wish fulfillment that is coming here, something that is long awaited, okay, that is going to be happening very quickly, okay? You could have also had some type of tower moment in love, some type of disruption that is going on, okay? Seeds are being planted, okay, or um, this is like um, a male ejaculating as well, okay, is what I see. All right, take it how it, how it resonates for you guys. But I feel Spirit is saying that you guys have all the tools necessary to be able to uh, manifest this brand new beginning in your life. All right, you guys could be kind of walking around the house, um, kind of like with some nice um, lingerie on, okay? Or you guys could be thinking about um, so, uh, purchasing some type of lingerie, but I feel like you guys are walking around with some type of lingerie or some type of um, sundress on. It doesn't matter what the weather is. I just feel like this is the energy you're in in your home. I feel like you're feeling very sexy, garden vibes, okay? Um, very colorful energy here as well. Pink could be um, a factor for you. That could be your favorite color, okay? Okay, or um, just the colors that are around you, all right, or resonates with you. We have this page of pentacles here. So there is a friendship here. There's a new beginning. There's a stable offer that is here. I'm getting friendly vibes, okay? Your neighborhood, your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man is the energy that I'm getting. You guys could like Spider-Man or watching Spider-Man, okay? There's a lot of success for, for here for you, a lot of travel, okay? I'm hearing genuine, okay? So there's something genuine that is coming in, all right? It's kind of like you're, you're some type of dancer as well. You could be um, you know the dancers that be all wrapped up in the fabrics and stuff I can't think of their name yeah you're very very sexy whoever I'm talking to okay we have the uh, the, the deck the title card you are a badass being full of life love and possibilities may you find a path to your best self okay Virgo all right, but yes, you definitely have a lot of success here. Some could be traveling, could be um, business traveling. Also, spirit and your guides are very happy for, for you. They're proud of you for what it is you're doing. I feel like you guys have been on a very long road, uh, Virgo, and you're coming to a point to where it's like you're meeting a friend or someone is meeting you on the road. Someone sees you on the road, and they're going to come and offer you their friendship. They're going to come and offer you their help, their assistance, or whatever the case it is that you need. This person is here for you. I'm hearing angel. So literally, you guys could be getting something from an angel, some type of surprise, okay? Or you could be meeting somebody, let's say, at a, at a store, and they say, hey, you know, um, I feel connected to you. You know, let's do this work or let's do something. Um, and then, like, it's just like a quick interaction, maybe. That could have been an angel. So let's say you guys connect with them, go for coffee, and then they end up giving you um, $20. I don't know. If that was meant to happen, you know, and maybe you'll never talk to them again, or maybe you will, but I feel this person is not going to be in your life for a very long time. I just feel like there's some type of something that's come it's kind of like a 
Like the, the spirit guides are blowing something your way. And it's like, you need to open up your hands to catch it, Virgo. Okay. So it's like, don't miss it. You're not going to miss it. You can't miss it. But you know, just it's maybe kind of mystical or magical how you get it or kind of like, oh, that was strange. Or you may just get a phone call out of nowhere, you know, and the only numbers they had was your old numbers. How they get my new number? I don't know. You know, just something like that is going to, uh, to come through. Okay. And it's for you it's for a brand new start or it's something to help you here. Okay take this how it resonates and that could be what you're having to make this choice here but again i feel like this could be a surprise as well look you're the queen because you're the queen you're running shit virgo i hear that's what i'm hearing you're running shit okay you're a boss you're um you could have a corporation i just feel see like a woman in like a a pant suit just like walking through the hallways or something like she's just running shit she's the boss she owns her own organization okay i also feel uh, many of you guys are entrepreneurs and creators but you guys are leaders okay Okay. You guys are having boardroom meetings and things of that nature as well. Okay. You guys are very witchy. You guys are also growing a garden or want to grow a garden or, or something like that. Uh, I feel like your your spirit guides are in the garden, okay? Take it how it resonates or it's like they're in the plants or something, you know? Some of you guys may need to water your plants or you guys need to get plants. The breath of life in, in you know, that good prana, bring it in inside, you know, and, 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 and the, as, as the best way you can. Also, open up the window, fresh air energy, okay? Sage your homes, cleanse, up, cleanse out your space here. Okay, Virgo, look at what wanted to pop out. We have the two of cups and then we have the five of cups. Okay, so there's some type of emotional disappointment with some type of partnership that is here that you guys are having. Okay, um, you guys are looking back on something or somebody is looking back on something. Somebody has a re some type of regrets in regards to a connection. Okay, and here you are, Virgo. Here you are focusing on your money. Okay, focusing on your goals, focusing on your way forward. Could be dealing with the cancer. I'm hearing chariot. You guys could also be purchasing a car, but you guys are moving fat, uh, forward very fast. I'm also getting train energy. You guys could be in New York as well, um, but I just um, or Chicago. Um, but I just get a lot of business vibe, a lot of business in, uh, energy as well. But this also could be like a business deal gone bad, a partnership that's gone bad. This could could be a, a marriage. This could be a relationship. This could be a connection. This could be family. Whatever this is, there's some type of emotional disconnect between you and another party, between you and another person. Okay, and again, it could be business with this Queen of uh, Pentacles down here. Also could be dealing with um, another Earth sign or also could be dealing with a fire sign here. And like I said, Gemini or Virgo here as well, okay, um, that you could be dealing with. And Cancer energy, uh, I saw earlier, I felt Cancer energy here as well. But definitely, Virgo, there's some type of disappointment here, some type of regret. Somebody also may want to mend something and come together, okay, as well. Take it how it resonates. But again, you guys, are focused on your money you guys are focused on fast forward or moving forward okay wearing your crown proudly okay your crown chakra all right i feel like your crown point your crown crown point i feel like your crown chakra is on point okay so virgos i am going to leave your uh your read here i was getting ready to say call for whatever reason so maybe a call is coming through you guys could be getting a call right now or expect a call take it how it resonates but virgo i am going to leave your read right here uh please comment below how it does resonate if you guys are interested in a personal reading personal coaching or donating to the channel you guys can do so at the link below please like share and subscribe to the channel i am nayla latrice peace